G'day, it's Dave. I thought I might do a recap on what we pulled at our pre-release. Obviously, we got three boxes, one for myself and two for my daughters. And I hadn't really, really looked into Lost Thunder that much. Um, I knew that it was going to be a massive set. Now that I've looked at the cards, yeah, it's going to be massive. Um, it's going to take a good while to get them all. But I'll flick through them. Obviously, a lot of people have already seen them, so there's no point of going into them too much. The reason, I guess, that there's a big set is because there's a lot of double-ups uh, of certain Pokemon. Um, so we're just going to flick through them. Like there's another double-up. And some cool cards as well. There's my first GX of this one. Another double-up. Kind of cutie, could be. Um, yeah, it's going to be an interesting how this plays out. I really love this one and the artwork is very like hand painted sort of watercolor. Um, it'd be interesting how it all plays out with our decks for the next sort of phase. Um, there'll be a few cards that'll be used. I like these guys, they're like a surrealism sort of picture. Um, yeah, so it'd be interesting how it all pans out uh, going forward to <clears throat> the regionals and also like. Uh, yeah, um, world titles next year, so, um, I love that guy, so cute, like a 60s, I oh know, what is it, yeah, a 60s dance party, sheepy, I was going to flick through him, that, as an ability, is going to wicked, it got me undone a couple of times today, um, skunk fist, Espeon, didn't really look at this one, but that's going to be kind of important, I guess. Unknowns, Warbuffet, as long as this Pokemon is on your bench, Prism cards in play. Oh, that'll be, that'll be handy. There's a lot of cards that have abilities now. Once during the may they touch the base, you can... Oh, that'd be cool. That was handy today as well. I love that one. It's like an Aboriginal party. Uh, picture, sorry. Painting. Oh, Bananas and pyjamas. So going back to it, uh, there's just a heap of double-ups to go up. Hollow and a reverse. Jiggy. For another Prism Star card. As I get into focus, that is kind of cool. I like that one. Mimikyu GX. So I got a box coming this week, hopefully, and we'll have a good crack at that. Hopefully, uh, gonna film it um, in six parts. And tag it with um, friends of our, or friends of mine up in north of Tassie, and have a pack battle. Another Prism Star Heat Factory. That'll be handy to drop out some um, electric to the Lost Zone. That's handy. That guy. Uh, mixed herbs, especially that one. Removing that one, playing two. And it's 90 retrieved or damage, and you get rid of your uh, the special condition on it. That'll be handy as well to pull out three under 60 on your bench. Away you go. And final four are the promo stamp cards that we've got. Sorry about that. It's got disturbed. So. The Lost Under promos that we pulled, obviously, with the three packs. One, two, and three. And our final one was the beautiful Rainbow Shuckle. The only downside is this side. And as you can see, the cut is terrible. But as a card, it's actually not... It's really plain. Some of them are really, really... Flame and cool, and then some are just kind of plain, but he is pretty cool. 
And that is it for my Lost Thunder uh, pre-release. Thank you and take care. And hopefully do some more videos and you can like and subscribe to my channel. Bye-bye.